Previously on the most popular girls in school. Today's the day that we show everyone that Overland Park is the best damn football team in the entire state of Kansas. The moment we take back everything that was taken from us. I just wanted to make sure you're ready to execute Operation Lose the Fucking Football Game. There is a music festival that's absolutely raging out here in the parking lot. Suck my dick. Oh yeah? Why don't you come over here, pull down your pants, stick your dick in my mouth, and say it to my face? And that's gonna take us down to the two-minute warning. What do you think about the action in the first half so far, Bert? Wait, huh? Wait, whoa. Was I asleep? Yes, you most certainly were. Sorry, I tend to fall asleep when I'm watching things I don't give a shit about. Was I talking in my sleep? Uh, <laughs> well, uh, <laughs> uh, maybe a little. Christensen is back to pass. He's looking deep in the end zone, and it's... No, no, Vasquez. I delivered all the drugs. He hands the ball off to McGran, and he... Hey, if I had your money, would I be half naked in this broth of wearing knee pads? And he's looking deep for Derringer, and it is... Well, you tell Blake Sheldon to shove it up his asshole. I didn't say anything too embarrassing, did I? <laughs> you sure did. Now, let's get down to our sideline reporter, Caitlin Cameron, who's with some of our great fans. Caitlin! Well, Clint, it seems that everyone in the state of Kansas is partaking in hip cella stock a outside in the parking lot. So there's really no one here. Back to you. God damn it, this is fucking ridiculous. No one's even here. Hey, who the fuck are you calling no one, bitch? Hey, Brett! <laughs> Shay, do you want to sit here and bitch? Or do you want to fucking cheer? You're the one that wanted to be head cheerleader. Fine. It's a good thing I'm getting paid for this. Uh, Shay? Yeah, we're definitely not getting paid for this. What? Yeah, who the fuck told you that? Brittany? Ha! <laughs> fucking idiot! <sighs> Fine. Give me an O. You've got your O. You've got your O. Give, Give me a V! No, thanks. I enjoy pee. <laughs> like penis. Get it? I'm adorable! <sighs> God damn it. All right, well, that's the end of the first half with the game tied at 14. Let's take a look at some of the highlights so far from today. Early action from the first quarter as Shawnee Mission jumped out to a quick lead behind star running back McGran. Here he barrels past the defender and puts the Vikings up 7 to nothing. Burke. You wanna take the next one? Uh, yeah. The guy throws the ball to his friend, then his friend does good, and then he lays down after a while. Thank you, Bert! Moving ahead, the Grizzlies would tie things up late in the first as Deandra, the girl with the robotic arm, lays a heavy hit on Shawnee quarterback Robbie Harrison, causing a fumble that would be recovered in the end zone. Midway through the second quarter, Oyce McGran answers the bell again, taking a handoff straight up the middle for a 62-yard pickup and his second touchdown of the game. To add insult to injury, he then proceeds to jerk off in the general direction of the Overland Park bench. Just before the end of the half, though, Overland Park would answer back one more time. Chris Christensen finds his tailback, Matthew Derringer, on a screenplay that goes for nine yards and a score. We're at halftime of the Kansas State Championship with a score. Shawnee Mission West 14, Overland Park 14. Oh, oh, oh. oh, man, finally, the Illuminati, you guys got my letter. Hello, Than. Hello, Than. Hey! Oh, Judy, Judy. Oh, oh, yeah. I did. Hey. Oh, it's just you guys. Sweet cloaks. What's up? Oh, we were just stopping by to make sure you were ready to do your job. Yeah. Jenna would be awfully disappointed if you didn't follow through. Oh, is Jenna here? No, Dan. She's taking care of the concert. Yeah, the Barrio brothers are having some issues with their cellist. Getting pretty crazy out there, man. Yeah, but people are really nice, though. This one guy gave me some brownies he made. They did not taste good. <laughs> Jenna, did you eat the brownies that were being passed out at the concert? Uh, yeah, why? Oh, good lord. What did we say about the brownies people pass out at concerts? Um, that they're probably laced with drugs. And what would happen if you ate them? I would probably get super high. And then what, Jenna? I would ruin everything. You would ruin everything! Ugh. Well, how long ago did you eat them, Jenna? I don't know, like Lizard 30? 
Oh, like lizard dirty. Oh, great, Judith. We're going to have to take her to the medical tent. Hey, stop it. What are you doing? Oh, shh. I just want to feel the words coming out of your mouth. Like, like feel them. Oh, wonderful. By now, she's probably got two pounds of the weed in her stomach. Oh, you guys, I'm so thirsty. I'm so thirsty. Eh, sounds more like ecstasy if you ask me. Oh, ecstasy, great! It's fucking party time over here, huh, Jenna? Party, party, party! Yeah, you fucking dummy. <laughs> I'm your Kate. Oh god, this is embarrassing. Okay, Dan, it's go time. Yeah, don't fuck this up. You try the game, football team loses. You got it? Yeah, I got it. Yeah, don't make us come back here. You don't want us to have to come back here. Jenna, Jesus Christ, put your shirt back on, you fucking bitch. Turn down for what? Oh, uh, hey guys. I was just, uh, I just had to, uh, masturbate. I mean, um, no, actually, you know, that works. Masturbate. <sighs> All right, Sam. <laughs> Welcome back. Please take a seat, okay? Preferably not next to me. Ahem. <clears throat> Gentlemen. What is the key to winning? Teamwork. Uh, no, that is not correct. Uh, hard work? No, God, no. Oh, fuck no. Jesus. Uh, athletic ability? What? No, Jesus Christ. Everybody knows that the key to winning is a great halftime speech. All the greats, Emilio Estevez, Kurt Russell, Al Pacino, Denzel Washington, they all knew that championships are lost and won in that locker room at halftime. And we've come a long way. At the beginning of this season, well, uh, actually, I wasn't really on this team at the beginning of the season, so I can't really comment on that. But now, look at us. We're an elite unit. We're going toe-to-toe -to -toe with the two-time state champions, and we're giving them all they can take. Now look to your left, and look to your right. Those aren't your teammates. Those are your brothers. Now look to the front. I'm your sister. Now look up. Haha, <laughs> I made you look. Now look forward again. There's no team on this planet that can beat us. The only team that can beat us is sitting right here in this locker room. There's a big scary guy out there they call Oishin McGran, and he wants you to suck his dick. Are you gonna suck his dick? No. Are you gonna suck his dick? No. Are you gonna suck his dick? Pass. You guys go out there. I want you to remember, nobody comes into our house and pushes us around. Clear eyes, full hearts, can't lose, and ducks fly together! All right, let's go win All this right. game! I feel good. This one's for everyone. Hey, Than, Than, Than. Uh, what are you doing after the game? No, oh, I don't know. Maybe go see if I can't catch the end of O-Town. Well, uh, I was just thinking, me and Tristan and a couple of other guys, we're gonna go grab a bite of hula hands. Tanner, I get it. You're really cool and have friends. Jesus, you don't have to brag about it. No, whoa, Than. I think you're misunderstanding me. I was asking you if you wanted to come with us. What? Oh, oh okay. Hey, what about if we lose? No big deal. If we lose, that's even more of a reason to want to hang out with the people I care about most in my life. See you there, buddy. Oh, man. I'm home landing so bad right now. I've got to throw the game for Jenna. But the guys actually want to be my friend. Ah, oh, right, what would Brody do? What would Brody do? Excuse me? Yes, Brody from Homeland. What? Whoa, whoa, what? Hey, popular people, thank you so much for watching this episode. This is just part two of our four part season finale, so next week will be part three. Don't miss it. Things are just getting started. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you haven't already and like this video. We love them likes. It makes us feel so warm and fuzzy inside. If you haven't caught up on this season, catch up right now. It's not too late. Just two more episodes left and it all comes crashing down. Don't forget to check out our awesome MPG at store where there's all kinds of amazing merchandise and right now we have a special deal where you get $5 off any purchase over $30 by using the promo code 5 off 30 So take advantage of that. Go find out for some cool shirts you don't have with some amazing curse words that's going to make your mom very ashamed to be your parent. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye.